Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my fellow YouTubers, Facebookians, and subscribers. Today I'm going to be sharing with you news that I've got about PlayStation 4. Now a lot of people says, including my assistant, let's just get this out of the way first, that this big PlayStation event coming up February 20th will not be about PlayStation 4. Every place I've seen and read is about PlayStation 4. They might not release all of the information, but apparently the president of Sony in Japan says he ain't releasing anything until Microsoft brings out the, Swan, the 720, codenamed Durango, supposedly. This is the first I've heard it this morning. I haven't done any research on Durango. Personally, I find Microsoft to be iffy on systems when they blow up. So I'm with Sony, and I'm with Nintendo, but more so Sony and PC. But this ain't about what system is the best, no. Me and my sis assistant, one of these days, will sit down in front of the camera here and do a video of what systems are the best from the past to the present. Look for that video soon. Now, about PlayStation 4. All we know is the controller will probably be the same as the PlayStation 3, 2, and 1. And basically the configurations of the Vita and the PSP. Well, I've also heard coffee by the way and not booze some of you like my videos about booze other things I've heard is the logistics of the uh, PS4 under statistics is uh, approximately and I've heard this from various sites 380 or 360 million or something 380 million I believe dollars million was invested in a cloud server program in Japan for PlayStation 4. Sony's been putting a lot of money. Some say they put a billion, some say they put 600 million, some say they put 2 billion, etc. But anyways, the money is not that important. The point is, they invested money, floated it into it, and rumor has it that they're going to set it up so you can download PlayStation 3 games to um, your system. Now, me and my system, uh, me, and my, uh, me and my assistant, assistant, not system, my assistant, Aaron. Aaron knows I get a little combative when it comes to gaming news, news in the papers. But today he says, no, they're not going to do it. I said, well, they might not. They might. No one knows. It's just some Sony PlayStation event. That's everyone's talking about PlayStation 4. Now, PlayStation 3, no one knows. Some say it's like 50 gigs plus of space. 50 gigs. However... Skyrim to download like 5 to 12 gigs, supposedly on Steam. I haven't got the, the the statistics and numbers, but it's a very big number, so you'd be downloading for hours. You even have 3 megs, 5 megs, 7 megs, 15 megs, or cable internet. But as everyone knows, cable slows down uh, with too many people on the system, I think, for television and crap. But anyways, enough about that. They said that they're going to be allowing... PlayStation 3 compatibility with PlayStation 4 through downloads. Now, some say it's going to be discs, some say whatever. But, we'll see what happens in four days, and I will report back to you then. But, in the meantime, we can all speculate till the cows come home. PlayStation 4 news is coming out. E3 will be out in four months, apparently four to five months. So, let's see what comes up in four to five months. All right? PlayStation 4 news isn't that big because there's nothing much except for download, a build compat uh, download PlayStation 3, they say, is what might be happening. I've heard rumors it'll be backwards compatibility with PlayStation 1 and 2. Who knows? We'll find out in time. In the meantime, please add and subscribe if you like. Please post comments in the box if you like. And please add me as a friend if you like. And may the Creator bless you in everything you do.